predecessors for tasks and milestones are entered into the predecessor column. They establish the sequence in which tasks are done. The predecessor is the task that comes first. A task that comes afterwards is a successor. The number in the predecessor column indicates the line number of the task of the predecessor. Phases or tasks automatically become summary items when tasks and subtasks are indented under them. Generally, they do not have predecessors and are not used as predecessors. The lowest level tasks and milestones should all have predecessors, so they are linked into the flow of the project. Usually, the only low-level task without a predecessor is the very first task of the project. A task or milestone can be used more than once as a predecessor. In this example, a milestone is the predecessor for three tasks. A task or milestone can also have more than one predecessor. In this example, the task is three milestones that have to be completed before it can start. This is done by typing the line numbers into the predecessor column. Separate the line numbers with commas.